I'd like to welcome everyone here. And on behalf of Sarah and myself, I'd like to welcome you all and thank each of you for coming to celebrate this very special evening with us. You are here for a reason. Somewhere along the way, you have impacted each one of our lives. Special thanks to Jacob's parents, Jan and Rick McKinney, for raising an incredible young man. I continue to be amazed at the love that you have for my daughter Addison and for the Lord. I've always said that as a father, I cannot ask for much more than that. Other than now, you have to provide for her, and you will need God's presence in that part, trust me. <laughs> I also want to thank my wife, Sarah, and my daughter, Caroline, for the countless hours they put in to this event. And I'm going to tell you all something. They have put in a lot of time for this thing to happen. So I'd like to raise my glass, or our glasses, to Addison. You've been a tr truly gift from God. I'll ever, forever be grateful to have been given the honor of being called your daddy. you were born 10 weeks early to today because I'll be more proud of you all of your accomplishments and the extraordinary woman you've become remember that your family always has your back and no matter what we will always take care of you can't imagine how our lives would have been without you for the last 25 years your mom and I have been so blessed, and I thank God every day for you. I love you to the moon and back. Jacob, you're now responsible for fostering that love. Kind of tough to follow that, isn't it, Jacob? I am confident, though, that you will do that. I thought as I was writing this speech, and I've been writing it for a very long time, I kept thinking, I'm losing a daughter, and I'm losing a daughter, I'm losing a daughter. But at the end of it, I really realized I'm gaining a son. So, Jacob, welcome to our family. We love you. We cannot wait to see what God has in store for each one of you. I ask and take you, Jacob, to be my wedded husband. And I do promise and covenant for God and these witnesses to be your loving and peaceful wife, in plenty and in wine, in joy and in sorrow, in sickness and in health, as long as we both shall it. I, Jacob, take you, Addison, to be my wedded wife. I do promise and covenant before God and these witnesses to be your loving and faithful husband in plenty and in want, in joy and in sorrow, in sickness and in health, as long as we both shall live. You may kiss your bride. life together begins now and it will take a lot of turns some will be up and some will be down but at the end of the day you will always have each other ladies and gentlemen turn this. it's my privilege to present to you mr. and mrs. Jacob Evan McKinney Your voice, the heaven of our kiss, the 
Sure I'm scared But I'm all yours So please 